Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will learn about shaft tool. We can find the shaft tool at this location. Shaft is a revolved feature created about an axis. This feature adds material to the sketches. Click sketch icon. Select YZ plane as sketch support. Draw an axis. Draw a profile like a tapered shaft. Click constraint icon. Select axis and line. We can see that distance constraint is being applied. Let's ignore it and right click. We can see radius and diameter option. Select radius and diameter option to apply radius and diameter constraint. Double click on the value to enter the desired radius or diameter. Exit workbench. Select shaft tool. Shaft definition dialog box opens up. Select the sketched profile. We can see that axis is automatically computed by Katia. Click preview. We can see that revolved shaft feature is being created. Using first and second angle limits, we can manipulate the revolved feature. Click OK to close the shaft definition dialog box. Click sketch icon. Select YZ plane as sketch support. Draw a profile like a tapered shaft. Exit workbench. Select shaft tool. Shaft definition dialog box opens up. Select sketched profile. We can see that axis is not automatically computed by Katia in this case because we did not create an axis inside the sketch. So we have to manually select the axis in this case. We can select any linear element from sketch or we can also select a line created using reference elements toolbar. Click cancel. Click line tool from reference elements toolbar. Select a line type as point and direction. On the point tab right click and select create point. Select point type as coordinates. Let's keep x, y and z coordinates values as 0 millimeters. Click OK. We can see that point is being created. On the direction tab, right click and select Z component. We can see that line is being created. Click OK. Select part body and right click and select define in work object. Now click on shaft tool. Select the sketched profile. Select the created line using point direction option as an axis. We can see that now revolved shaft feature is being created. Click preview and OK.